coming to you from the street guy? Because of his vision and... Um, why is that? Uh, because of his uh, track record. Okay, why is he your candidate? So, because that man is, is good. And, uh, House of planning. my religion, that is why I love him. I think he's the best for us in Nigeria this time around. Okay, is there any reason why you think he's... What's up my beautiful people, it's your girl Stephanie Kalia and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is coming to you from the street, yeah? And I just want to ask Nigerians what they think about the upcoming elections. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, how are you? Fine, sir. Please, can we know your name? I'm Apostle Gabriel Yusuf. Okay. Um, please, sir, I just want to ask you a few questions regarding next year's election. In which of the country? Nigeria, sir. Okay. Okay. Um, who is your presidential candidate for next year's election? Uh, honestly, I don't belong to a political party. I am praying that what is happening in this country so far will change come 2023. It is time for God to intervene to Nigeria. So it's time for youth to take over. We need a vibrant youth. We need somebody that is competent, somebody that we can rely upon. So, so far, so good. I'm praying for Peter Obi to win election. Thank you. Okay, why Peter Obi, sir? Peter Obi has a record that is outstanding compared to other candidates that are aspiring for next election. We have uh, Atiku is there. He was there as a vice president of Nigeria. We have uh, Tinibu Uru Lagos years ago. And we have Peter Obi who has handled Anabra State, some almost eight years and beyond that. And among the three, he has an outstanding record. He's competent. He has experience. He's, he has gone around almost the whole world. And when he was there in Anabra, there are records to show that he's not coming for selfishness. He's coming to change Nigeria for better. Thank you. All right, sir. Thank you so much for that opinion. No. Okay, may we know your name, please? I'm living in popularly known as Fresh. Okay. So, please, um, I just want to ask you who your presidential candidate is for 2023 election. Um, my presidential candidate for 2023 um, is Atiku Abubakar. Okay. So, may we know why you are going for Atiku Abubakar? Yeah, I'm going for Tiko Aboka because of his vision and um, what he has done in Adamawa State. You see, I think a part of the state government in Adamawa State, Atiku is the second employee. So I think him being the president um, of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, he will definitely give the youth job. And he, groom, he work with more youth too also, yes. Okay, so what party is he coming out under? PDP, People Democratic Party. Okay. Good afternoon, right. sir. Uh, afternoon, how are you? Fine. So we just want to find out who your candidate for presidential election is and why. So, my candidate is, is Atiku Abubakar. Okay, why is he your candidate? So, because... That man is, is good, but, but the, the house of plan is my religion, that is why I love her. So, the Tiko Abakar is good, you understand? So, it's hard the, they are hard the, Yarike Masang Assistant President for back. So now if in the Aiki Mekyo 
ke gyara wurare abubuwa da duye kamata zai yi so and tani wuma duka is in my candidate okay good afternoon sir good afternoon please can we know your name please my name is ibrahim okay ibrahim so i just want to ask you a question about the upcoming elections who it's your presidential candidate for next year's election. Ah, obedience. <laughs> yeah, we are obedient. Okay, your candidate, your candidate is Peter Obi. Peter Obi, Peter Obi, no other person, Peter Obi. Okay, may we know why, please? Of course, it has to be Peter Obi. If not Peter Obi, who else? Given the three candidates, without even, you know, let's say, let's take a look at the antecedent, what they've done. If you bring the three of them and say, you give them needle and thread, say, okay, they should put pass the thread through the needle. Among the three of them, who do you think can do it? Peter will be probably. That's very, very simple. And Peter will be is, is somebody that economically is sound and um, uh, he's not, uh, he's, he's straightforward. He's straightforward. That's why they are saying he's a stingy. It's not, it's not, we don't, it's not going to come and steal our money. It's somebody that we believe that, yes, it's going to take Nigeria to the next level. Not all these uh, old people that believe in sharing. He said a thing that he's coming to take Nigeria from consumption to production. That means a lot to us. So it's no other person than Peter Obi. Okay. So which party is Peter Obi coming out from? It's Labour Party, uh, for now. All right, sir. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon. Uh, may we know your name, please? I'm Patricia Mikaswa. Okay. Um, I just want to ask you a question. Um, who is your candidate for 2023 presidential election? My candidate is Peter Obi. Okay. Why is he your candidate? I think he's the best for us in Nigeria this time around. Okay, is there any reason why you think he's the best? Yeah, we are going for a better thing and we think he will be he will he will like make things easy for us in Nigeria. Okay, so you think with him Nigeria will be a better place? Like create job opportunities and a lot more? Yes. Okay. All right. Yeah, good afternoon. Okay. Please may we know your name please? Uh, this is S B Simon. Yes. All right, so please, sir. We would like to know who your candidate for the presidential election is and why. Ah. My presidential candidate, as a neutral Nigeria, I think I believe on uh, Peter Obi. Okay, why is that? Uh, because of his uh, track record in Anambra State. Okay. And so, because of that, in fact, he really convinced my mind that he is a credible somebody that I should vote for. 20, coming 2023. Okay. okay, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Okay, my name is Stephanie. What's your name? Please? I'm Idris. Idris. Yes, sir. Okay, I just want to ask you what you think about the upcoming election, who your candidate is, and why. Uh, my candidate is uh, for the president is Engineer Rabio Musa Konkoso. Okay. I think Engineer Rabio Musa Konkoso is the right man for Nigeria. See, in the a lot of work he has done in Kano State, he helped the poor masses. He sponsored some youth in, in to uh, India and other uh, foreign countries to go and learn a lot of things. For Engineer uh, Rabiu Musa Konkoso is the right candidate for the youth. Okay, so yes, you've heard from him. Engineer Konkoso is his candidate for presidential election. So, sir, we just want to ask you. A few questions concerning next year's election. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Please, who is your presidential candidate for next year's election? For President Atikum Abubakar. Okay, you are going for President Atiku Abubakar. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Um, why, sir? Because I love him with my vision. I see Atikum Abubakar, he will help us in this Nigeria. Okay, why do you think he will help you? Why are you going for him? Most of times I always see some things that God told me that it's good to me to choose Atikum Abubakar. Okay. Yeah. 
So, and what party is your candidate? PDP. Okay. Okay. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. May we know your name, please? My name is Daniel. Daniel? Yes. Daniel Aite. 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 Yeah. Aite. Yes. That name doesn't sound Nigerian. Yes. Where are you from? From Ghana. Oh, really? You're a Ghanaian? Yes. Wow, nice, nice to know. Thank you. How long have you been in Nigeria? For the past 16 years. For the past 16 years? Yes. So I can say you have an idea of what's happening and what's going on in Nigeria, right? Yes, I have more. I can I have witnessed more, so. Okay. So, sir, if given an opportunity to vote, who would you rather vote for for the presidential elections coming up 2023? Uh, the presidential election, I feel said I will vote for Peter B or Atiku in the two reasons. Okay, so for each, can I hear your reasons for each? The, what I can even say is, person like Peter B is something that is a, is a good candidate for Nigeria. But for now, it's have not prepared. Let's say Atiku, try and see whether he can do something. Okay, so Peter B would have been a great choice for you, but you feel he's not prepared to run Nigeria? Yes, yes, that is my opinion. So why do you think he's not prepared? One, we are talking about states. In Africa, when we are talking about election, election is not like a state. It's a nationwide. So you have to sell more. People have to know you, what you can do, what you cannot do, and what you have already done. That's why I said Peter B is best candidate for Nigeria, but is not prepared. Okay. Why in a candidate not gonna election next year? Next year, President Kogobro. Presidential election. President Inshallah Konkoso. Konkoso? Twenty twenty three Okay, why? Uh nine be small boy inside them. All they don't all now. Okay, Mr. You need to become small in the prison now. Okay. All these, all, all people make the go. Okay. Uh, so, Mesa can I say she? Nothing. She 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 Okay. So, can I say you today as if that's election? No. Okay. Child love. You're not when you party in here? You're not partying ANPP. ANP. ANP. You're going to go? Yeah. Yeah. ANPP. Yeah. 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 So we've come to the end of this video guys. You've all heard what Nigerians have to say about next coming next year's upcoming elections. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe and press on the bell icon to get notified when I upload my next video. Bye guys.